वंदे गुरुपद्वंदम भक्त बिंदु समन्वित श्री चैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नित श्री नंद नंद नंग वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन समयुक्त बिंदन मनोहर वाशा कल्पतरु वश्य के पास इंदु व्यवश अतिथान पावने वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुखंकोति वाचाल पंगुंगल हृतगिरी जत्कि पातमहंग वंदे परमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव वै पिया वै केशव सच स्नभक्तिपदे देवी सत्वत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरुचनोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पात्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरु भक्ति युक्त भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदर धेय सदा परिभवन भविष्यदूह तीर्थास्पद शिव विरंजन तम शरण्यम भीतात्म पनुतपाल भवादीपूत वंदे महापुरुषते चरुनाथविंद यदपल्लवन खचंदमनी छटाय विस्फुर्जीत किमी गोधुस्वदर्श पूर्णागर सुसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामी कदा कृपाम करोषि श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नेतानंद श्रीअद्वैत गदाधर शिवासदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नेतानंद श्रीअद्वैत गदाधर शिवासदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनका बुदात संकीर्तन कवितरो कमलाक्ष भीषाबरो द्विजरो जुगधर्म पाल वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणाभतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 नमा गंगे तव पादपंकज सुरासुरवंदो दीप भुक्ति मुक्ति दिनी भावान्ूपेन सदा नरान गंगा तरंगरमणीय जटाकलाप गौरी निरंतर विभूषि तो बाम भाग नारायणो प्रिय मनंग मदापहारम वाराणसीपुरपति भज विश्वनाथ बागीशजुस्वदने लक्ष्मीजस्वक्षसी जैसे संबीत सिंहमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 
राम राम हरे हरे भेदते हृदय गंथी छिदंते सर्वशंशया खियंते चर्माणी दृष्टनेवात्मनीश्वरे हृदते हृदय गंथी छिदंते सर्वशंशया खियंते चर्माण दृष्टनेवात्मनीश्वरे गौरिय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी भगवान परमंश जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट बॉन्डेड सोल कैन नॉट अरेंज पर्सनल मंगल बाय पर्सनल एफर्ट एनी अमाउंट ऑफ एफर्ट कैन कम फेल्यूर गौरिय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपात परमंश जगत गुरु सेट दे बद्ध जीव बद्ध जीव कैनट अरेंज एबसुल्यूट मंगल बाई हिज पर्सनल एफर्ट नेवा इफ एट ऑल ट्राइंग टू अरेंज एबसुल्यूट मंगल जस्ट ऑपो जस्ट ऑपोजिट हैपनिंग I mean, they want to arrange mangal, but the amangal coming in their life. Just opposite happening. It is not possible for bonded soul to arrange mangal, absolute mangal. In fact, they don't understand what is mangal, what is not mangal. They are driven by their own whimsical attitude. they are approaching finally when they meet with problem they say we are in problem what to do this is the pope speaking in this material world in this material world whatever arrangement you are making for you all temporary whatever arrangement you are trying to secure your life you are making life insurance you are driving uh, uh, driving you know insurance everything you are car insurance everything you do but what is there what is there you will have to and so bonded soul like to secure his life Ultimately, cannot secure. Not possible. Whatever they are in their luck, they are going to meet with that kind of luck. Nobody want to invite problem in their life, purposely. Nobody want to invite problem in their life purposely, but still problem coming. Similarly, people like to ensure their happiness. Nice, no problem can be there. Still, problem coming. So, the only solution is to that is that we will have to submit hundred percent unto the lotus feet of Sadguru, who can arrange absolute mangal for us. It is one kind of. False philosophy. People thinking. People thinking. It is one kind of false philosophy. It cannot be so. But Pope was speaking. The whole, the complete responsibility. The responsibility of my complete mangal. The responsibility of my complete mangal. given into the hand of such a exalted personality who is a representative of bhagwan or he bhagwan himself coming he is my guru so my mangal all everything all the responsibility of my mangal complete mangal 
the responsibility of my complete mangal given into the hand of such an exalted devotee who is the representative of Bhagavan. He is my guru. Prabhupada used to say, I cannot submit unto a lotus feet of common guru, those who can give my partial benefit. Prabhupada speaking, surely, surely I am not going to submit unto a lotus feet of such guru who can give me partial benefits. He who can give me hundred hundred percent benefit. He who can give me hundred hundred percent benefit. Absolute benefit. Only I can submit unto a lotus feet of such guru. Otherwise I cannot submit. I cannot submit unto a lotus feet of common guru. Papa speaking, people getting guru according to their past sanskar. Somebody getting Karmi Guru, somebody getting Gyani Guru. This way, so-called Guru, somebody speaking cheater. So, is according to their own Sanskar, they are getting. Sanskar is very important. Same thing Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking. But before that, I like to discuss one very important point. That it is the duty of disciple, first, to dis, first the, the first duty of disciple is to submit 100%. Is to submit 100% and to say Guru. That is his responsibility. Because Gurudev cannot interfere with that. Gurudev surely cannot interfere with your free will. You are free. You can submit, you cannot submit. Or you can 50% submission, you can so as up to you. But if you so 100% submit, then it is more practical. Because then Gurudev can control you. Remote control is there in, into the hand of Gurudev, provided you are 100% submit. If the disciple is there in America or in England preaching, Prabhupada can control them from here. Prabhupada control them from here. In my life also, so many such incidents. In my life, so many such incidents happened. By the help of which I was 100% sure that Gurudev guiding me. This is 100%. So many incidents, I don't like to, you know. So, we want to be controlled by the Supreme, Supreme Divinity. We want to be controlled by that Supreme Divinity, or I would say, we want to be controlled by Shuddha, Guru Vaishnava, I mean Guru Pad Padma and Vaishnavas. Each of our act, each and every action, each and every action in our life, like speaking, looking, hearing, sleeping, taking prasadam, whatever you do, you think I have my personal liberty. No. So long as you think you have your personal liberty, you, you lead your life with personal No objection. We have no objection. We have no objection. You can lead your life. Papa speaking. Papa speaking. Many times Papa speaking. Pope, many times Papa speaking, those who deserve. Papa speaking, those who deserve that we have our personal right, personal... I have no connection with them. Papa speaking. Those who think we have our personal uh, right, liberty, why Gurudev going to interfere with us? With them I have no connection. They have not seen me, I don't know them, who they are. They think that he have taken Harinam and Dikha from me, I have no connection with them. After taking Dikha, they are gone. They have no connection with them. Continuous, uninterrupted, connection 
should be there. If there is any time, any fraction of second, breakage of connection with Guru Padma, I will be in great problem. But you cannot realize it. You are only hearing philosophy. I know it. Any fraction of second, if I break connection with Guru Padma, I can feel some suffocation. Somebody going to control my oxygen. This is the truth. Like one fish taken out of water, feel suffocation, going to die. If this be the condition in your life, then be sure you have connection with Guru Padma. Otherwise, uh, general diksha, general connection, general. The first symptom, the first symptom after taking actual diksha, the first, whenever you take diksha, if you are 100% is right, the first symptom, you can feel, after taking diksha, you can feel immediately, immediately, if you are humble submission, 100% right. Immediately after taking diksha, you can feel that this material world is like dream. I have no connection with the material world. Immediately. You need not wait. You need not wait. Immediately you can feel. Otherwise, someday if you can, someday if you can develop 100% submission, then you can feel. Now in general you can go. In general you can try. First point, Gurudev can give realization that with this material world, your husband, wife, or children, or the material world, all, anything in this world. You have no connection. You have no connection. But you are feeling connection. That is your foolishness. Tulsidas Ji Maharaj, Tulsidas Ji Maharaj, the great devotee of Ramchandra. He told in Hindi, I think you don't know Hindi. In Hindi, Tulsidas Ji Maharaj told, Sadguru mele ved batave gyan kare upadesh, kaila ka maila chute, jab aak kare pravesh. Very simple word. Even those who are uneducated, not so educated, have some feeling, they can realize. Sadguru mele ved batave. When you meet with one Sadguru, the first point, first benefit you are going to Sadguru Mele Bhed Bhatavi. Guru going to give you power to feel that this is material, this is a prakito, this is prakito. Now at present, this is the status of our diksha. Even we cannot understand the matter, and, uh, this is an a prakito and a prakito. Minimum common sense. Common sense is not developing. Common sense, even common sense is not developing. This is prakita, matter, and this is aprakita. Basic thing, most basic thing. They cannot understand. So, Tulsida Ji Maharaj speaking, Sadguru Mele Bhed Bhatavi. Sadguru Mele Bhed Bhatavi. Sadguru, when, when Sadguru coming in your life, by the desire of Balaram Nityananda, when Sadguru coming in your life, Sadguru going to give you clear conception about this is prakit, Prakita and this is Aprakita. So long you are going to concentrate in matter, Prakita, because this is very root, deep rooted problem. This is very, very deep rooted problem for everybody. Because our attachment with matter has gone so deep that to cut the tree, I mean, if you think your body is tree, it's very difficult. One tree, just one month ago, you plant, you can eradicate. But when the tree is 100, 200, 300, 400, 500 years, or maybe 3000 years, then it is impossible. Where the branches gone down, 
where the oh the root gone such a way you cannot even detect where gone oh impossible this is our condition our demand and desire all all our demand and desire has gone so deep rooted that now if gurudev going to cut then we can gurudev if gurudev like to make one operation then you can start revolution you can start agitation no i cannot allow you we can think gurudev is enemy same thing in my life same thing in bhagavat sami i am this same thing in my life everybody thinking i am enemy most of the people most of the people they think i am enemy that is the reason because i am not going to cheat them if i could cheat them they could think me friendly because i am not cheating that's why they think most of the people they think i am enemy so what to do this is a problem so tulsidas ji maharaj speaking maharaj sadguru mele bhed batave gyan kare upadesh when sadguru coming in in my life going to clearly indicate my son this is matter and this is chinma a prakriti and prakriti you have no connection with matter because you are atma you are not body but paro opi manute anartham tatkitan chavi paddate bhagwan speaking to uddha paro opi manute anartham do atma is para vastu chinma hai no connection never in infinity period there was purposely we make actually atma they cannot have a connection they cannot have any connection with matter but they are making connection that's why bhagwan speaking paro opi manute anartham tat kitan chavi paddate do their they are chinma like bhagwan eh but still this is the problem due to maya they are in maya are they are feeling all pain and pleasure coming and going this is a they are busy with virtue or vice or auspicious activities they are always busy but bhagwan bhagwan going to declare in gita i have no connection with those I have no connection with your good activities, bad activity, whatever you are doing. I never told you. I have no connection. I never told you to do it, but you are doing it. I have no connection. Good or bad, good or bad, whatever you are doing, that is your responsibility. I never told you to do it. You are going to put yourself in the network. I mean, in trouble. नादत्त कसचित पापम नौचैव सुखदिम विभुम आई टोल्ड यू टू डू सिंपल एक्टिविटीज वेन आई टोल्ड वेर आई टोल्ड यू सो मी आई नेवर टोल्ड यू टू डू सिंपल एक्टिविटीज और आई नेवर टोल्ड यू डू डू पायस एक्टिविटीज नेवर आई टोल्ड बट यू यू आर सेल्फ डूइंग अकॉर्डिंग टू यीवियस एक्टिव पीवियस कर्म फॉल यू आर गोइंग टू लाइक अ मैन overpowered by ghost like a man overpowered by ghost doing all rubbish going to open cloth naked because ghost catching ghost overpower then he can in chaitanya charitamrita the same example in chaitanya charitamrita the same example krishna das kobir has given but you don't understand bengal pisachi paile jotha moti channa hoy मायबद्ध जीवर है से भाव उदय पिशाची पाइले जथा मतिच्छन्न है मायबद्ध जीवर है से भाव उदय भेरि क्लियर सो क्लियर कन्सेपन नो फादर कैन गिव इन दिडियो सो क्लियर भेरि इजी 
Like when somebody is overpowered by ghosts, is all consciousness is covered up. A same thing happened when Maya Pisachi, Maya is Pisachi going to overpower you, then you think it's okay. I am feeling comfortable. Nice AC room, car, everything all, eh? billions of dollars in bank. In Vaishnava Parad book, just uh, today or tomorrow you publish, who publish, I don't know. That man, I think. Same thing Gurudev told. Same thing. That somebody thinking, huge amount of money collection, so many temples, so many disciples, eh, can identify that he is a great devotee. Guru Bhagavan, no, this is not the identity. On the contrary, it can prove that this is the result of your Vaishnava Parad. Guru Bhagavan. This is the, eh, on the contrary, it can be proved that this is the result of your Dasavidha 10 Nama Parad or Vaishnava Parad. Anyway, Vaishnava Parad also, 10 Vidana. Guru Bhagavan, maybe it is the result. Why you are giving so many money position? And yeah, yeah, like, like your reckless driving is problem for you. Reckless driving, no? So one Acharya, when in Maya, is reckless driving. He cannot control himself. Come on, in foreign country, so nice their road, signal, everything. How it is possible that Lady Diana meet with accident? She is queen. Royal family. Prince Charles, his wife, but she is also not feeling a satisfaction. Why? You see, who can, then who can? If she is not feeling satisfaction, as a royal family, so much facility, what not there? But still she is not feeling satisfaction. Prince Charles, so nice looking, so tall figure, very nice person, but is not feeling. He liked to get the association of some young boy. Okay. And ultimately what happened? What happened? She meet with, with some accident, so that after accident, policeman cannot identify that this, this, this is the body of Lady Diana. Even policemen cannot understand. They are making some investigation. What is the whose body? Who knows? Finally it was detected. By DNR, DNR testing, finally it was with your body. So, yeah, totally masked. So you understand, this is the condition of bondage. If you think, I need, I need 2 crores, 5 crores, 10 crores, after I give, you can feel satisfaction. You can feel satisfaction. You can put guarantee. Bamanji Maharaj, Bamandev wanted to speak same thing. Bamanji Maharaj in front of Boli Maharaj wanted to say speak same thing. Boli Maharaj speaking, you are a small Brahman boy, you, you have no maturity. Oh, why you are going to ask a three footstep or lamb? What you can do? Even you cannot sit comfortably. Even you cannot feel comfortable. Three, your leg is so small, three footstep, how much you can get? Oh, oh, you have, you have no idea, I mean, you have no maturity. So, I can give you one continent, what do you say? Oh, you so like one country? Okay, if you not country, some villages I can give you. Hey, you can take. But Bamandev is very strict. Bamandev speaking, what I want, you will have to give, or if you don't like to give, I cannot take. Okay, okay, well, well. Bhamanda speaking, I need that one. Because Brahman Vaishnavas, if they are going to accept more than their necessity, then they are going to lose their power. You should announce it. Nobody knows. Some foolish word, idiot. Someday, our some devotee, I don't like to name, is speaking. 
Many times this kind of offer came. Near Bulansar, Delhi, one devotee used to hear my Harikatha, Hindi, staying there. He is speaking, Maharaj, uh, somebody is going to give you one crore rupees minimum, but you will have to do this, this and this sign. I say, one <laughs> yes, I can give evidence. If you want, Maharaj, it's true, I can give evidence. I told even one rupees I don't want from him. I don't like to sign paper, nothing. I don't want even one rupee from him. So you see, because I know the far-reaching consequence. America, even our devotee is involved here actually, he take information that some so-called, uh, no, not devotee, he like to give all his property, billions of dollars, in the name of him, Sadhu. So he suggested my name. In the meantime, he engaged one devotee to reach that place, to accept that donation. You see the arrangement of Maya Devi and how Bhagavan protecting me. I love Bhagavan so much. He engaged one man who is very obedient. You can immediately go and show all papers, everything, and in the name of Baba, you can take all property from there. In the meantime, from another society, one man immediately going there to accept that donation, and he was in, uh, he was in trap, because traffic jam. He was in traffic jam. He couldn't reach that place on time. So the whole property was given to that man. And that devotee crying in Maharaj or property. And it is the blessing of Bhagavan. It is the blessing of Bhagavan that he could not reach that place on time to accept that donation. So you are crying. You don't, you don't understand the desire, desire of Bhagavan. You are crying. You cannot see the desire of Bhagavan. No, you should realize. You should realize very it could brand. So all the arrangement of Maya Devi. If one sadhu cannot go out of Maya, then what version he can do? He even is not out of Maya, giving diksha everything. Ah, take it. Even he himself is not out of Maya. His, all his activities, everything going to prove is within Maya, trap of Maya. This is a very fearful situation. So, Bamanji Maharaj, Bamande, small, Bamande speaking to Bali Maharaj. Bali Maharaj is popped up. I am king. In front of me, if somebody going to ask us three footstop lamb, it is just insulting me. Because if I go to one king and asking, king speaking, what do you want, Baba? Hey, Maharaj, what do you want? I need some ass. Ass? Are you ass you can get anywhere, idiot? Why you are coming to, to ask ass from me? Huh? Foolish. Ass anywhere available. I thought you were going to make some money, position, everything. Ass. So same thing when we are demanding some thing from Krishna, Krishna speaking is rubbish idiot number one. He is going to ask some rubbish ass from me. I can give, I can give myself to him. Come on, I am the only property in the infinity world. I can give the this treasure, I can give myself to him. But he is going to, Maharaj, I leave this building, property, Are, stool and urine you need, it's available. In a, you need stool and urine. It's available here outside. Why you are taking trouble to come to me? Why? So, Bamanji Maharaj speaking to Bali Maharaj. Maharaj, up to now, up to now, no king, no king could prove that they were satisfied. Any of them. Nobody could prove, nobody could, could prove their situation, they are satisfied. Nobody could prove. All Nahush, Goy, or even Indra, who? Who else? In this world, those who got the whole sovereignty of all over the world, still they could not prove 
that they were satisfied. So, for Brahman Vaishnav, they never expect anything. If somebody, oh Maharaj, I keep it for you, you take. Okay, they can use it. No, for seva they will do, okay. But they, because they know, if I am going to take something from them, what I need, that I need. What I need, that I need. But beyond our limitation, if you, de if you demand something, if you accept, then you are going to lose your bhajan power. That's why Sadhu Guru is so clever that they never want to get. If somebody given, or if you like to use your ma money for wife, children, or uh, for maya, you can do it. If you are lucky, you can give. No, 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 no need. But Sadhu Guru is very careful about accepting anything. Because they know, if I am going to accept anything, and there is any attachment inside heart, then I am going to lose my bhajan. I am going to lose my bhajan. So anyhow, I cannot lose my bhajan. Okay, Madhukuri I can take. Madhukuri is more practical. You have no attachment, you are giving something, okay. You have. But if you give billions of dollars, you have attachment. But if you give something, okay, donation, Madhukuri. Okay, Madhukuri, okay. This way, Bhamanji Maharaj speaking, Maharaj, in the history of this human being, never it was discovered that some Maharaj could feel satisfaction by enjoying all oh, subordinity, everything, money, position, Lord. So, I want what I, what I need, what I need that you can give. If you don't like to give, I am going, I don't need it. You like to give three foot of three footstep of land. If you agree, I can take. Ah, don't speak anything to me. Follow. So all those incidents going to teach us. All those incidents going to teach us how careful one sadhu should be. How careful, how alert, how much alertness there. They can see past, present, future, back, who is doing, who is, who is looking at me, with what mood, they can feel everything. So much alertness, right, back, side, everything they can. So alert there. They never like to make any mistake. Because in Chaitanya Chaitanya, already I told, Whenever you are overpowered by one ghost, then you can do. You are out of your control because consciousness level gone down. Now you are overpowered by ghost. So what to do? Krishna Das Kubira Goswami is saying, when Maya going to overpower you, what is good, what is bad, is authentic, is illegal, all you can forget. All you can forget. All you can forget. I know you have education, you have logic, everything, but all you can forget. Whenever Maya is going to overpower you, you are compelled to do that wrong, sinful activities. Same thing, Krishna Tolna. Same, same thing when Arjun wanted to ask, when Arjun wanted to ask to Krishna, so who is going to engage? Because most of the people, they don't like to do sinful activities. Atho kena prajuktvayam. Atho kena prajuktvayam prapan charati purushaha. So I like to know who is going to engage people. They don't like. But still they are doing. How? Atho kena prajuktvayam prapan charati purushaha. Why they are doing? Anichya nopi. They don't like to do sinful activities. But they are bound to do. Anishan no pivarse, barseo, bala adiva, as if somebody is going to forcefully engage. Forcefully going to engage, go. The same thing. Bhagavan speaking, I am less interested about your pious activities and sinful activities. Don't speak anything to me. I am less interested. 
Whatever you are doing according to your fanciful mood, I am not responsible. Oh, Bhagavan speaking. No other take a sachit papam, no chayi was so kritim bibum. Ogyane no avritam gyanam te no mu yanti yantava. They are covered up by Maya. They are totally covered up by Maya. That's why they are doing this. I have nothing to do. Ajnana no avritam gyanam. Ajnana mean ignorant. Maya. Ajnana no avritam gyanam. Te no muyanti. Why people are uh, feeling uh, hypnotized? Hypnotized, you know. Some psychiatrist is there. They can take you into dark room. And after that you can sit there and they can do gradually they can gradually you can go into coma state and whatever they can ask you will have to speak they can ask question psychiatrists they are doing sometime so whenever you are overpowered by maya so naturally whatever you are them whatever doing Shuddha Atma has nothing to do with that. Atma has no demand, nothing I told. The property of Shuddha Atma is a Gyanmoy, Chinmoy, Chinmoy, Gyanmoy, Anandamoy, Prakashmoy, all I told her. Chinmoy, Gyanmoy, full of knowledge, Chinmoy, transcendental, Gyanmoy, Prakashmoy, Falgens, and if their Atma is there inside body, then the Atma can, due to the presence of that Atma, all my limbs and all activity, I mean the influence of that Atma can go in each and every limbs, all nervous system. There is a influence. Like Mahaprabhu speaking, if somebody is going to put one Chandan, you know, very costly chandan. This much chandan, 10,000 rupees. Hey, this much. Malaya chandan. If that chandan, if you put some drop here, whole day, Mahaprabhu speaking, all your body can be cool. Malaya chandan. Mahaprabhu giving this example. Like one mother, Malaya chandan, one tip, if you put here, whole body, have Malaya chandan, can keep your body cool whole day. Similarly, due to the presence of that Jivatma, Atma, eh? all your limbs, all your nervous system, all feeling some power. I mean, the, due to the presence of that Atma, all limbs going to express the symptom of your life. All limbs all your body, all your nervous system, everything going to prove your, you are alive. Your life, going to prove that life is there. Similarly. So, Bhagavan speaking, Atma is there. But Atma has no connection with all these things, but still feeling due to Maya. They are overpowered by Maya. This is a condition. So, Tulsidas Ji Maharaj speaking, Shadguru Mele Bhed Batave, Shadguru Mele Bhed Batave, Gyan Kare Upadesh, Kaila Ka Maila Chute, Jab Aak Kare Pradesh. Tulsidas Maharaj giving a very nice example. Same example Mahaprabhu told. Same Bhagavan. Shadguru going to give you complete idea about how to distinguish between matter and antimatter, I mean chinmaya and matter, how you are going to put your, how you are going to put yourself into bondage, how you are going to make you free, all this conception Gurudev can give you, provided you are in time. Same thing I am speaking. Otherwise you cannot get. Gyan Kare Upadesh is going to give me Gyan, Dibba Gyan. And like the coal, Coal is very black. Coal, you can, if you collect one coal, you can see very black, very bad looking black. 
coal is black, na? Charcoal or coal? But Tusida is speaking, when fire is going to enter into coal, then the blackness totally vanishes, get vanished, and it takes the form of molten gold. Tulsidas is speaking the same thing, Mahaprabhu also told. The blackness of coal, blackness was, surely blackness was there. Because on those days when our childhood, boyhood, we have seen mother cooking by coal or a wooden piece. Where does not gas coming? Gas coming, previously there was no gas. Our mothers, they used to put so much energy. Oh my God! Coal. The coal, we have, we have idea. Coal there, fire, then the coal uh, in full, full glowing condition. You cannot discover that the, that the coal was very black. Nobody can speak. Because now, it has taken the form of molten gold. Same example to Siddha speaking. When Guru Padma bless you, I mean, if you are qualified to get that blessing, if you are qualified to get that blessing, the Guru Dev can give you. Because same condition Bhagavan told. Tadviddi panipatena paripasana sevaya upadekshanti te jnanam jnanina stattva darsha. Guru Dev has nothing to, you have nothing, we, you cannot blame Guru Dev. One cannot blame Guru Dev. Guru Dev is ready, always ready, waiting. Who among you qualified? Come on. But we are not qualified. We cannot blame Gurudev is not giving. Gurudev is waiting to give, but we are not qualified. Whom to give? So, Bhagavan speaking in Gita, Tadvidhi, be sure, Pranipad Paribhishna Sevaya. Three conditions you will have to fulfill in your life before taking Diksha from any exalted devotees, Mahapurush. Pranipad. No, you cannot reserve anything, secrecy inside your life. Panipat. Total false ego gone. Paripasno, self-inquiry. From heart, no duplicity. Sheva, Sheva mood. All you will have to prove. Then, Tattva Jnani Purus, Tadviddi Paripadena Paripasno Sheva, Upadikshan Ti Te Jnanam. Jnanina Stattva Darshinaha. Those who are Guru, they can keep you again. And you can also catch that knowledge. In this condition, so many knowledge going to you, but you cannot catch, you forget everything. In my whole life, never I cannot rem I can never remember that I made one note of Guru Padmanda Harikatha. Guru Padmanda used to speak Harikatha. Because Guru Padmanda told me especially. That everybody, my son, everybody recording Harikatha. Everybody recording Harikatha. Follow. But you will have to record Harikatha here. Guru Padma told. Guru Padma told. Everybody like to record here. But record here means you can become lazy, you cannot take trouble to hear it again. I know you very well. You are so lazy. So try to record here. Guru Padma used to say. Try to record here all Harikatha. So that you can keep it for infinity period, forever. So whenever fire entering into coal, coal going to change its total sarup, it can take the form of a molten gold. Similarly, when a Dibba Gyan that transcendental knowledge of Prakita Gyan, Gurudev giving to me that knowledge coming inside me and previous blackness, I mean all anartha, all sin, all can get vanished and uh, uh, your sarup can express like fire. Now you can give knowledge to others. Now you can be in this condition why Shatsisha is so important? Shatsisha means Shatguru. If I say he is the Shatsisha of that Guru Padma, that means Shatsisha means he is himself Guru. 
What is the meaning of Satsisya? You know the inner meaning of Satsisya. The inner meaning of Satsisya is that he himself now Guru. Now he can act as Guru. So, somebody is going to elect and select by board, council board, but Guru can never be elected this way. Popa told. Hundreds of such examples we can say, elected, selected, but fall down. No common sense. What to speak about Dibba Gyan? Not even common sense they could get. So whenever the Dibba Gyan coming inside, then you can also show light to others. Dibba Gyan to thousands of bonded souls. You can show. You can also show light to those who are ignorant. There is a condition. So now you understand how Uddhavji Maharaj going to pray to Bhagavan. How Uddhavji Maharaj going to pray in front of Bhagavan. That Prabhu, I have some question, I am in confusion. I am in confusion, I cannot realize because previous, pre because uh, before I heard from you that I will have to follow Vedic rules and revelation and everything. After that you told, uh, you follow the knowledge, you know, way of jnana. Now you speaking, you leave everything and come to me. You should realize, you should realize why Bhagavan you should realize one very important point. That why Bhagavan wanted to remind Uddhav about Gopi Prem. Because the feeling of Gopi Prem was arranged by Krishna when he was sent to. But now what is the reason? Bhagavan is now speaking to Uddhav about all the secrecy, all the topmost love affair. I mean bhakti, serving mood of those gopikas. Again, Uddhavji, Krishna going to remind. After that, immediately, Bhagavan speaking, that now I am speaking, Tashmat tam uddhavo utsrijya chodanam prati chodanam prabhrithincha nibhrithincha srotabhyam sutamevacha. Ma meka meva saranamatmanam sarvadehinam jahi sarvatmo bhavena maya sha hi akuto bhayaha. First of all, Bhagavan wanted to make some background to remind Uddhav about the speciality, the most, topmost speciality of those Gopikas and their love, pull, seva, serving mood, which can never be their. Krishna can never pay them. I already told you. Then why Bhagavan Sri Krishna is going to remind? Immediately after that, Bhagavan speaking, now I say you all what to do, what not to do, what to hear, what not to hear, Veda, Veda, all you leave. All you leave everything. And come to me. Are you? That's why. Why? Bhagavan wanted to say, just like Gopika. Gopikas. They were not interested about about Shuti, Siti, whatever. They were left. only the thing, only the one thing they wanted to give totally. They wanted to give themselves totally unto my lovers. Without any background. Oh, there was no conception in the life of Gopikas, they, they never wanted to consult uh, Veda or Vedanta or Upanishad or any Puran, no. So the inner meaning, Bhagavan wanted to speak to Uddhav. I wanted to remind the mood of Gopikas. So you are my dear and near one. I wanted to give you the best, the topmost gift, Gopi Prem. 
But you are putting question, you will be feeling nervous. I wanted to give you, you are my dear and near one. I wanted to give you the most secret treasure. This Gopi Prem, I wanted to I wanted to see you established in Gopi Prem, but you have become nervous. You're saying how, why, why and when, this kind of question. So Bhagavan speaking, Jahi Sarbotu. Jahi Sarmatma Bhavena Maya Sahi. You try to submit unto my lotus feet totally. You leave everything, whatever. Then why you wanted to give me so much advice? You could speak it. One time, same question I told you yesterday. Same question, Arjun speaking. Are you are a long time you are speaking this, that, or now finally you are speaking. Sarvadharmanam Paritaju Mahabegum. This you could speak much before. This you could speak? Bhagavan said, no. After that, Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, Uddhav, whatever, whatever, you know, gyan, knowledge I have given to you, be sure, I am going to make you one representative. I wanted to make you guru. So, Guru can, Guru can give knowledge according to the capacity of disciple. Some disciple coming, just newly coming, is cutting family bondage coming. So whatever knowledge Gurudev is going to give to that new karma, surely he cannot give to one mature devotee who is for a long time serving Guru. Same thing Prabhupada told. In Chaitanya Mahat, some senior devotee told to Prabhupada, Prabhupada, now we can, uh, now we can, uh, you can speak this kind of thing to that, you know, that new devotees. We can give this, we can discuss this. Prabhupada, no, not at all. Let them mature their hearing organ. First of all, let their, let their hearing organ get matured. In Bengali, Prabhupada, you should say, Tadir Shobanind, Tadir Shobanind Yota Toidi Ho. Get matured after hearing all general things. Then after that, when they can get matured, then you can speak. So, one Gurudev, surely, who is coming just, uh, you know, one month ago, Gurudev is not foolish, he can give the knowledge, same knowledge. But at present they are speaking. Those who are coming from home, they are all dirty life, they, they are already late, they are dirty life. They are coming, you can hear about Rasa Leela. This is a foolish conception, one foolish Acharya. Never, nowhere speaking. Nowhere, because there is no maturity. Even they cannot keep their bed pure. One Brahmacharya Sanyasi, if he, if he cannot keep his bed pure, then he is not at all sannyasi brahmacharya. He is not. First of all, he must give guarantee. His bed, everything is pure. Then he can be and accepted as brahmacharya. And it is not possible. Whenever he is enjoying full kipa Gurudev, when he is out of illusion, maya, all around maya is there, he cannot touch the heart of that devotee, then he can become Brahmachari. What is Brahmachari feeling attraction for a man? This, ah, okay, it can happen so. It's not that. They are trying. But trying also under the guidance of some foolish devotee. Our trying, when we are, when we are, when we are speaking, we are trying, we are trying. Same thing you are repeating. Like computer. Like computer, we are speaking, we are trying. We are, are trying under the guidance of whom? Under the guidance of a foolish man, if you are trying under the guidance of very exalted devotee, why you are not getting results? For the past 10, 20 years, I am trying, I am trying, what you are trying? If trying at all sincerely, why not getting result? If you are trying sincerely, you are not getting result. It can happen so, I can believe. It cannot so happen. So, Bhagavan ultimately speaking to Uddhav, Uddhav, if you think 
I am giving all this preliminary Lord, everything what I gave before, at present giving. If you think I am giving to you and for your benefit, then you are, you cannot understand me. I am going to keep you as a representative in this world, as a guru. So, I, it is my duty to keep all different kind of tattva vigyan in you. All. So that anybody asking any question, you can give answer. One acharya, what is position you don't know? Somebody can put question for you, from scientific angle. Somebody can put question from different, different angles. So, he should have that kind of guru kipa to give answer, proper fitting answer. It can, it can never so happen after getting the answer of that Sadguru, Shishyo cannot feel, uh, oh, uh, not satisfied, not ten so well. After getting answer from Sadguru, disciple can get satisfied. It is a symptom of Sadguru. He can give, he knows your heart condition. You can give answer accordingly. And it is a vital quality, and the, the most vital quality. One Sadguru should cut all the doubts and suspicions inside the heart of one of his disciples. Should have that kind of power. If not, then disciple can express doubt about your guruship. So, when Bhagavan Sri Krishna is speaking this way, just after speaking all in details about all Gopikas, immediately switch over to this point. Uh, Uddhav is in confusion. You, first of all, you told so many things, and now you are going to speak that you leave everything and come. So, Uddha speaking, Sangsayaha Sinnatu Vacham Tabu Jogeswari Swara. You are not Jogeswar. You are Jogeswari Swara. You are going to bestow Kipa to all Jogeswar. All power coming from you. So, you are not Jogeswar, you are Jogeswari Swara. So, I have my full faith in you. But now I am in confusion. I cannot uh, realize what you mean to say. So, Uddhavji Maharaj is going to express his doubt. Sangsayaha sinnatu bacham tabo yuge swareswara na nivartato atmasta jena bhammati me manaha. Now no, my, no, mind is, you know, shaking. I am now in you know, unstable condition. I cannot understand. Because previously I heard this thing. In the middle you told this thing. So many things I heard. For. Now you are just telling just opposite. You lay everything and come to me. I cannot understand. By leaving Veda, Vedanta, all ritualistic, all rules and regulation, I can go into hell or not. But surely I believe you. You are there. So, so I think there is no possibility that I can go to hell. But still, all my doubts and suspicion is there. Very deep. So, please you know, try to take me out of this suspicious and you know. I seek your help. So, now Bhagavan speaking. Bhagavan speaking, the, if I can prove that all different instruction in Veda, here, there, all, whatever, all done by me. Even Veda, Vedanta, all I myself, I myself coming in the form. So if I am successful to prove to Uddha, Uddha, Veda and me, non-different. So don't worry. And whatever instruction given before, I know. Whatever instruction given before that I know. But I like, I like those devotees, those who 
I like those devotees very much, those who are going to keep aside also rules and regulations when they are driven, guided by their natural, loveful mood of seva, so I feel very happy for them. Be, be sure, Udhap. Agya yoibam gunano dusano mayadishtano pi sakano dharmano santayyo yah sarvana maam bhajeto sa sattamaha. Bhagavan already told long before. I mean, 10, 15 days before I told you. Bhagavan told all my instruction. But if you are driven by this spontaneous, I mean, natural, loveful mood, of serving mood, then I like it very much. In fact, I am waiting to see. In fact, you say, in fact, I am waiting to see this kind of mood from jivas. Uh, you are not satisfied? Countless jivas are loving you this way. Oh, oh countless jivas loving. But still, I want new new jivas coming to me and show this kind of... I know countless jivas are there. I have no dissatisfaction. For still, but still my mood is that I want to see new new jivas can come up. Come up, come on, come up. I like to see their mood. Love. So I am very much interested. So Agya Vaibam Gunano Dusano Maya Dishtano Pi Sakano Dharmana Santayya Shantayya Ya Sarvana Mam Bhajeta Sasatama. Those who are going to put aside or general rules and regulation of dharma, adharma, or oh, you like I like to see there this kind of mood. I like to, I am waiting to see this kind of mood. With this mood, they can come and embrace me, love me, serve me. I am waiting for that. Now Bhagavan going to prove to, in front of Uddhav, Uddhav, don't worry. All Veda, everything, all I myself coming. I already yesterday told. Veda show chai shwaratma tat tatram yanti surayo. Why all money rishis they are in confusion to take decision, to come into conclusion? Why? Because Ved and I myself same. Ved and I myself same. That's why they are in confusion. Veda show chai shwaratma tat. Then confusion. So first of all, Bhagavan is going to explain how Beth came. Uddhav, perhaps you know that Brahma took birth from this naval portion. You know, na? Uddhav? Yes, I know. Brahma took birth from the naval portion of this stem. So, the Veda was resting in the naval portion first. After that, one lotus came out and uh, gradually four faces okay, were expressed, I mean four faces. That is, that is how the Veda started expressing in front of us. But first of all, it was in secret form. Para from, para, absolute from there. After that, came in the form of Pashanti, Madhama, Vaikhari. So from Brahma, so from Brahma, so from Brahma, in the form of sound, Veda came. But previously, Veda was in secret form. Finally, from the mouth of Brahma, it took the form of Vaikhari. So, all those Manirishis, they hearing what Brahma is speaking, they have so memory power that after hearing one time from Guru, they could, on those days, on those days, on those days, so power upon Brahmachari sannyasis. Even after hearing one time, they could memorize. That's why one name of Veda is Shruti. From in our childhood we read. That the another name of Veda is Shruti. Shruti means in course of hearing. There was no written form. Previously, 
Previously, there was no nothing in, in written form, all in voice. Voice. So after hearing, they could memorize everything. For a long time, it was the rules in our Vedic Yuga. But after that, people become forgetfulness, they're developing forgetfulness. Oh, I cannot remember yesterday what he told. This way, they're going to lose power day by day. One time, they are not going to take rice. Afternoon time, feeling very weak. Ekadoshi, I am very weak. I couldn't take rice today. This way, jivas in Kalikal, they become very, 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 very weak. Jivas become very weak. Follow. So, fasting is not practical in a Kali Yuga. More practical, how much Siddhanta Vichar you can remember and speak. And you can apply in your life. Fasting is not so. Yes, you can do fasting if you like. But be careful. Because the Kalikal, you should think about your body. So, Prabhupada used to say, it is more practical to take some Anukalpa and do more and more Seva. You should concentrate in Seva. But some Kapat devotees are there, they are hearing Arikata. Maharaj, I like to hear. But they are not. In applied form, they cannot so. They cannot so. They are kapat. So, Bhagavan speaking, Bhagavan vacho, shaye sajivo, vivaro prasirti, praneno ghoseno guham pravishta, manu mayam shuksham upetto rupam matra shoro varno itistavishta. Yesterday I already told. Bhagavan speaking, yesterday I already told. Yatha analaha khe, eh? khe anila. What speaking? Yatha analaha, yatha analaha khe anila bandhu rushma valena daruni adhimathamana anuhu prajato havisha samidhate Tathaiva me bhakti riyam hi bani. My Veda bani. Pradaye Veda bani yam Veda Sangeeta is Bhagavan told. Udva, after we can know. So, Veda was expressed in sound this way. I told two wooden log, dry wooden log there. Due to friction, some heat can generate, can be generated. After that, some uh, friction, due to friction, some uh, fire particle can develop. And by the help of wind, it can take a big form. This way, Bhagavan speaking, same way. Bhagavan speaking, same way, actually expressing. So, same thing happened. Same thing happened. So, Bhagavan speaking, Uddhav, I already asked you to take shelter unto my lotus feet. Different kind of six chakra, Muladhar chakra, Anahata chakra, so many chakra here up to this point. Agga chakra here. Follow. Here one chakra. Different chakra. Those who are yogi, they are concerning with chakra. First chakra here. When you're sitting, there's a backbone, backbone end, backbone end, there one chakra. From there, you have to unveil all chakra gradually. After the final agra chakra and but our bhakti procedure is so easy, we need not take so much trouble. Very easily we can realize it. Very easily, automatically it can be done. So Bhagavan speaking, Uddhav, all the activities, all the activities going on inside the body of one Jivatma, any activities, eh? any activity you are sleeping, yeah, eating, going, looking, speaking, Eh? Going to bathroom, 
to pass urine in stool, Bhagavan speaking, Udhav, nothing there except me. You forget that I am that Adhyayagantatta, that you make possible. Whatever Jeeva is doing, who Jeeva is? What is this world? All I myself, taking this form. Evam gaditaha karmo gati visargo grano raso drig sparsho sutischa shankalpo vijyanam mathavimanaha sutram rajas shattu tamu vikaraha. Uddhav, you cannot believe. All the activities, even what people thinking, all the activities, thinking, playing head, or any decision taking, taking smell, all activities, what not, everything, all controlled by me, I'm done, done by me. Even sankalpa, bikalpa, decision, whatever you are doing, all by me. And how it is operated, you know. Uddhav, you know how it is operated. It is actually operated by the three modes of nature. Rajasthamo, Shato. Now gradually I can unveil the mystery how Shato Rajasthamo Gun is going to get a magic control over you, all your activities. You are feeling hungry, you are eating, going to bathroom, going to sleep, oh I feel tired, everything, all activities. Uddhav, how it is controlled by Satoraja Tamagun, I can speak you, then you can realize. Bhagavan speaking. Evam gaditaha karmo gati visargo grano raso drik sparsho sutischa shankal babhigyano mathabhiman. I am very knowledgeable personality. You keep your knowledge with you. We don't need it. Because that knowledge is not a practical knowledge. Yes. So Guru Vaishnava, somebody asking me this kind of question. Maharaj, his great devotee, why he is going to uh, take the help of that, you know, very uh, material, knowledgeable person? It's called, you know, genius. Sometime Guru Vaishnava is going to engage some genius into seva. But people think it is a weakness of Maharaj, not that. Sometime Guru is just so clever, if sometime find some genius personality going to engage into seva. But outside people think, Maharaj going to engage. Why? They don't know. If Guru Vaishnava can engage their, those genius into some seva, they can develop some sukriti. They can develop some Sukriti. At the same time, Maharaj can give Kipa to them. So, this kind of genius people and their power of knowledge is not equal to Bhakti. Bhakti is completely separate thing. You are going to confuse. Oh, he can pass lecture nicely and in the university. Oh, so he is very nice. He can speak lecture, nice lecture. So he is surely his devotee. Are Maharaj, devotee, devotion, no connection here. Somebody can have this kind of power. Follow. Somebody have this kind of. But that doesn't mean he has bhakti. No connection with bhakti. Still somebody can pass lecture. That doesn't mean he has bhakti. The bhakti is totally separate thing and some genius people can have some genius, can some have some power, knowledge, okay? That is not bhakti. We think somebody can memorize Bhagavatam, uh, Veda, Veda, oh, he is, now he is devotee, nice, not that. Whereas Gaurakrishna Bhavaji Maharaj cannot quote even one single sloka from Vedanta. Gaurakrishna Bhavaji Maharaj can, can even cannot quote even one sloka from Vedanta. What do you mean to say? He cannot speak Vedanta, that, that doesn't mean he is not devotee. He is such a great, exalted Paramahansa devotee that Bhagavan Gaurachanda can give salute to him, can take him in lap. But you think that he cannot speak Vedanta, so useless. 
Ah, what you can do? You cannot speak anything. But you don't know the bhakti is totally separate thing. You are in confusion. Whole world in confusion. They are running to a, oh, they are exalted. Actually, they want money, position, glamour, everything. That's why they are going to join those societies and those gurus. Actually, they don't need the Bhagyan. I can solemnly say, I am so confirmed that I am, I am so confirmed that I can solemnly say that they don't need the Bhagyan. Only they come. Oh, it's very nice. Oh, the people can know and, and put some tilak, like Hare Krishna, I can speak. Oh, this. They can take some cakes and patties, this, that, so nice, tuk tak, very nice. They think it is bhakti. Hare Krishna, they think it is bhakti. They don't understand. I am 100% sure, so confirmed that I am going to say, solemnly I can say, they don't need the Bhagyan. They don't need, they don't need the Bhagyan. If at all they need the Bhagyan, if I see their face and activities again, they, they need the Bhagyan. That's why they cannot make fool of me. I cannot allow those people to come in front of me. I have no time allowed. No time. Phone is there for hot pot, Harikatha. I am not attending anybody. No, nothing. All silent. No, here only for Harikatha. Online. <laughs> and go sell information I need. Actually, because there is some problem, can be there. There's a reason. Nothing. I avoid those people. Go, go, go. Over here they can go. Very nice society there. Very many You can get nice size for Sadhana there. No, nothing there in Gosala. Go there. I have nothing. I am useless. Always I am speaking. So I lie. I want limited people. Those can get, those can get, actually those Dibbo can. Surely, those people, they cannot accept this kind of knowledge. They have issue to hear all, you uh, know, all, you know, common philosophy they hear. Or some gossiping, or some joking, they have issue to. How they can digest? You are not happy it, and if somebody is going to give you very rich food, you can lose in loose motion, you can lose. You can develop loose motion. So better you don't come. Or if you like, you hear about it. So, tomorrow I can prove that how Bhagavan Sri Krishna going to prove that the Shataraja Tamagun going to control over you. And just like in the field, we are going to throw shit, bow shit. According to that, we can get result. All I can explain tomorrow according to the desire of our Guru Varga. Tomorrow I can try to speak, okay? So, what sloka I started with? So you do Harinam, I can speak after. <laughs> All is speaking. So many things I need to remember, I don't forget actually. Yat shakta yo vadatam vadinam vai Vivada sangvada bhubo bhavanti Kurvanti chaisham muratma moham Tasmai namanantu guna yabhunme. This slok I didn't say. I speak another slok. I can speak. So you start Kirtan. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Krishna, 
कृष्ण कृष्ण हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल बोल हरि बोल ताई गौर हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल ने ताई गौर हरि बोल हरि पांच अकल पदों से के पास सिंधु भविष्यपति तानंग पापों ने भविष्य न भियो नमः